Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sav if you're new and today is the day. Today is the day that we are getting married and I need I just need everyone to cross your fingers, cross your toes, cross your butt cheeks, cross whatever you can cross that we have a smooth wedding. Every time I've tried to have a wedding in The Sims recently, it's just a disaster. It's a disaster. I don't know. My game just does not like them. It might be because I always try to invite like 20 plus Sims. So when I planned the wedding event, I only invited like, I think it was like 10, I think. I think around 10 people are going to be there. So <laughs> I just really want this to go smoothly. I want it so bad. But thank you for being here with me today. Cheers. Let's get into it. All right, guys, here we are back in the compost household. It is Saturday night. The, s the wedding is tomorrow at 5 p.m. Um, the first thing I want to do is show you guys their outfits. I did say I was going to choose their outfits and the venue off camera and I did do that. So I'll show you guys the outfits now and I'll show you guys the venue when we get there. I dress both the girls in white, but everyone else kind of has this like red and pink vibe going on. So let's start with Ren. Let's just go down the line. Um, Ren is the maid of honor, I believe. So this is her outfit right here. She looks absolutely beautiful. Um, there's no surprise there, but that's her outfit. And then for Marielle, we have... I went for a pretty classic wedding look with her. Veil, gloves, simple dress. Um, I gave her like all pink jewelry. With the bows and the hearts on her earring, the pink makeup, like, mm, absolutely beautiful. And then Sarah, I went a little... Uh, her outfit's kind of... It's pretty out there. Um, this is it. This is by Madeline, I think. I've never used this wedding dress before. I was like searching through my collection and I saw this and I don't remember ever using it. I think it's really pretty. I love the bows. I love the details. And uh, yeah, I gave her pink makeup as well and the little headband. And then Janelle, who is the flower pal. This is what we have for her. Just cute, pink, sparkly, beautiful. And then Eros, I think I put him in a red suit if I remember correctly. I did, yes. Adorable. He looks dashing. But yeah, that's everyone's outfits. I found a wedding venue on the gallery. It's like a rustic barn style. I feel like that suited them. Ren is sleeping. Marielle is going potty. Sarah is upset because oh she's upset because of her mom's death still i believe oh i also gave dolly a little bow <laughs> i kind of want her to come we did uh resurrect her in the last one which was uh really exciting um eros is narrate a tale of dolls well isn't that cute for his aspiration um all we have to do is get his mental skill I don't understand what's going on. We already did this sleep in a tree house for six hours, but it's like not registering. Um, but it's okay. I think I can just like cheat that later, but let's play some chess to get that mental skill up to level five. He's in a really good mood. So um, I think it's from the plum bite in the room. So we have uh, no needs for him to, to fix that before tomorrow. Janelle is sleeping. The plum bite is um, in her room. So all of her other needs are going up too. Oh, that was fast. Okay, cool. We completed our first aspiration for Eros. Um, trait earned, idea person, write, wait, paint, write program, and write songs faster without as much writer's block. Okay, well, let's pick a new one then. Yeah, see, it just, it's not even like registered that we've done it, but we still completed the aspiration. I don't get it. All right, um, mind and body. I don't think we've ever done this one. Become confident, achieve level three mental skill. Achieve level three motor skill, learn to ride a bike, go 12 hours without a negative mood lit, achieve level six mental skill. Okay, yeah, let's do that one. I mean, he's confident right now, so that should count, right? No? Also, we already are level three mental skill. I don't know what's wrong with my aspirations, but they don't seem to be working. <laughs> oh, well. I'm so excited for this wedding. I really hope that it works out. I hope that everything, um, I hope everything works smooth. I hope that you guys have been good though. I'm sorry I haven't been uploading as much as usual lately. I've just been just an anxious mess and I'm really trying to get over it. And um, it's weird, like I want to film 
but the idea of filming like makes me super anxious for some reason i don't understand but then once i start like i forget about it so it's just like that initial like getting started that holds me back but yeah i know that this is a safe space and i know that you guys won't judge me so uh okay we did it we did the first we did the first branch so level three motor and learn to ride a bike okay so we need to buy him a bike when is his birthday is this it dang his birthday's in five days one two three four five that's insane five days oh my gosh okay i'm gonna buy him a bike do we have sarah's bike in our inventory still that would be adorable if she passed it down to him i don't see it i wonder if it's still in her inventory oh my gosh she does have it <gasps> We should totally gift him the bike. That would be so freaking cute. Oh, he's about to level up his mental skill again. And Dolly just reached temperament level seven. Very good, very good. Okay, why don't you level up one more time? Perfect. Logic level four, what, what happened to mental? Oh, okay. Well, anyway, Sarah, come on, let's give him a friendly gift. Affection, give gift, friendly gift. <laughs> Aw, not the white hen dying. Aw, hi Edison. How are you, dad? Maybe giving this gift will cheer her up a little bit. I heard you wanted to learn to ride a bike. Well, it just so happens I still have my childhood bike. What do you think? Do you like it? I know it's a little old, but... Uh... Oh, he loves it. Okay, and it looks like that... Oh, what? Why did it make her flirty? That's sick. Why are you crying? Do extra credit. Okay, yeah, what a good boy you are. Wow. Oh, does Sarah need to help him with his homework? Yes, she does. I love that Dolly's back. Why, why do you keep crying? Missing them from grieving? Oh, right. He has the grief, the grief grieving style. <laughs> Sounds so weird to say. The sad grieving style, let's say that. Okay, I get it, my chickens are dying, jeez. All right, he did it. Now, let's learn to ride this bike. Oh, poor, poor boy. Oh my God, what if he asked Edison to help? Ask for help with bike riding, yes. Thanks for visiting, Edison. He came to see her the 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 night before her wedding. That's so sweet. What the heck? Why isn't this working? What if I take it out? Well, I guess no one wants to help him, so he's gonna have to do it all on his own with no training wheels. You got this. Just don't go in the house like Sarah used to. <laughs> Let's cheer up Dolly. She's feeling really sad. I don't know why. I wonder if horses feel grief too. Like her moods are fine. It's my wedding day, Dolly. Can you freaking believe it? I'm getting married finally! Aw, what a good girl. What does she want to do for her aspiration? Make a BFF? Well, it obviously has to be Edison. I mean, Eros, right? All right, well, we'll be taking PTO, obviously. I really hope the weather is nice in Tartosa. It does rain there sometimes, pretty often, actually. All right, yeah, and I also had to, like, restart the garden out here, too, because all of our plants, like, just disappeared. They all died and disappeared. It's quite sad. Yes, who's calling? Mm, a rider? Mm, no, I'm good. Thank you, though. Also, rank three. I usually get offers for like rank five. Our cow's gonna die soon. I think that the ne next batch of animals <laughs> that we get, we should probably try to like get a higher relationship with them. I do wanna like uh, experiment with the treats and stuff too. I've never done that before, but did you learn to ride your bike? Not yet. Okay, hang on a second. Janelle, can you ask him to be your best friend or no? Do you guys have, oh, your relationship isn't that high. Okay, well, let's just talk to him then. Console grief, aww. Yeah, let's just uh, build that relationship a little bit. We have about six, seven hours until the wedding. I wonder if playing in the treehouse uh, makes their um, relationship go up faster. This treehouse is seriously one of the cutest things in the game. It's just so freaking adorable. The little like, the little, I don't even know what you call it. Like pop-ups, little animations. Like, come on. Are you kidding me? They're playing fairy tale castle right now. <laughs> 
Oh, she's a princess. All right, I'll leave them to it. What are you guys doing? Try for baby? No! Oh my God. Imagine if I didn't catch that. Okay, Um, you guys can like be cute. Build up partner. Oh my God, cute. You guys can like flirt and stuff, but why don't, why don't we wait until after y'all get married to have a baby? Cause I definitely want them to. They have to. Oh my God, are they actually gonna go do it anyways? Oh, oh, I exited it out. Yeah. Apparently, apparently my game does not give a crap what I say anymore. This happened in my my life and death uh, let's play as well. My sim went to go woohoo in the crypt with that ghost, that elder ghost Waylon, and I exited it out and they went and did it anyways. I wish there was some cute like interactions that we could do like before the wedding. I don't really see anything. Recap? Recap woohoo? Oh my god. Oh my god. I just, I'm amazed every time at how much trash and how much de-stressing concoctions there are in this park. And, and, and a bunny little sculpture? So cute, so random. Are you ready? Wow, she just went through the wall. I mean, I guess, yeah, that's efficient. Is this the recap woohoo? Don't tell me. Okay, apparently. Oh man, all right, two hours. The wedding starts in two hours. <laughs> oh my god. I wonder if you have a high enough flower arranging skill, can you make your own bouquet for your wedding? Very satisfied, that's what I like to hear. Let me try, let's see if I have the wedding venue in... Okay, here it is. This is the wedding venue that I picked. It is by Flowerly, Flowery Simming. It's called Rustic Barn Wedding Venue. That is it. That is the venue that we're gonna be using. Um, yeah, it's really, really beautiful. I can't wait to show you guys. Does Ren have work today? Do we need to take a day off? We have work at 9 a.m. Okay, that's fine. Okay, wedding ceremony is in 30 minutes. Oh, enthuse about upcoming wedding, we can do that. All right, I'm gonna cheat everyone's needs, make everyone happy. Let's just do for the world so that our guests are happy too. I don't understand why events always start so late. Like, it's 5.48. I had it at 5. I wanted to have it later in the day because the fireflies start coming out at that time. And y'all know how I feel about fireflies. Okay, here we are. Wow, the flame pant, the matching flame pants. Mm, pretty crazy. Ren, what is this outfit? I mean, she's kind of rocking it, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> okay, let's get everyone in their proper fits here. Okay, what's this dude doing here? Why is Lane Coffin at our wedding? All right. <laughs> Where's Evangeline? Don't tell me I forgot to invite Evangeline and her daughter. Where is she? Where's Samantha? How come she's not showing up in anyone's relationship profile? There she is. Okay. Okay. Um, so yes, here is the venue. It's so pretty. We have a photo booth right here. There's the dance floor there. Bar. Um, inside the barn is like the place to eat. Isn't this so pretty? I can't get over it. Here's a little seating area. The cake's gonna go there. More seating, a piano. And then out the other side, we've got the altar. Yes, the altar. So gorgeous. So, so gorgeous. I'm gonna hire a piano or a bruh. Um, Hire a violinist. I cannot talk apparently. Oh yeah, you're gonna make a mess at my wedding? Wow, that is, that's insane. Okay, ceremony activities. I want to gather at the aisle right now. Everyone, please. She's like, hey, I'm getting married right now. I totally forgot to invite you, but you're more than welcome to come. <laughs> Wait, Evangeline is the officiant. She should just be here. I didn't have to invite her, did I? All right. So we're all gathering at the aisle. How do I get everyone to take their seats again? Please take your seats. Eros, get off your bike. Okay, here we go. I'm so scared. Now she wants to teach him to ride a bike? Here's the violinist. She better be good. Do I need to tell everyone to, to take their seats again? Oh my God. Eros, get off your bike! 
Oh my god. Dude, you did not. Okay, lights! Lights, please! Um, send down. There we go. Flower pal. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Not the terrible... Not the terrible violining. Oh my god. Okay, Eros, it's your turn. They're all wearing the same shirt. Oh my god. This is so bad. Hello? This is horrible. I'm not even gonna lie. Listen to speech? What? Oh my god. That's what you decided to wear? You look miserable. Are you about to give birth? Oh. Why doesn't this ever work? Oh, here she comes. Move, Evangeline! Not the detour. Oh my god! I can't. I can't with this. I literally can't. Your engaged partner isn't around? What do you mean? I knew it. I knew this wouldn't work. Let's go! Gosh darn it! Okay, here she comes. Why are you holding your bouquet like that? Why can't I do this? I guess I'll try placing another arch and see if that works, but... It's doing that glitch where it's like, your engaged partner isn't on, isn't on the lot. Invite them here. What do you mean? She's literally right there. I'm just gonna have to get them to elope then. So lame. This was such a bad idea to have Evangeline be <laughs> efficient. She's in labor right now. She's literally in labor. Well, where's the violin music coming from? I hate this so much. Will you move? You're the violinist and you're standing right there. I literally. I'm gonna fire her. I'm gonna do it. I don't care. You're fired. Just get married! Everyone's pissed because it's taking so long. Um, finally. Oh my god. Finally. Gosh darn. <gasps> Sarah's pregnant. What the heck? Is it over? Are they married? I I don't understand. Okay, yeah, it worked. It worked. That was pathetic. I guess blow bubbles. I guess throw rice. I. Not Mario feeling neutral to us now. What happened? Watch the stars and teach Eros to ride a bike. Okay. This is actually insane. Well, this is pretty. I'm a fan of that. God, what time is it even? 2.43 a.m. Insane. There is a lot of red going on. Who are you people? Get out of here. Oh my god, the cake is probably like rotten by now. Where is it? Why is there no cake in your inventory? This was- I don't want to say the worst wedding ever, but definitely one of the worst. Oh, Evangeline had her babies. Uh, she literally left the wedding to have her babies. That's actually crazy. Why are you going behind the wood to take a picture? Are you for real? Oh my god. I I have no words. Why did Ren leave? Oh my- Are you freaking kidding me right now? <sighs> Hating everything about this. Why is it so dark? Well, at least they got to have their first dance. Why did- She has a bump. Already. 
You know what? I give up. We're going home. I tried so hard. You guys know I tried my hardest. Ew! Not Stacy. Get out of here, dude. Bye. Yeah, look at me in my wedding dress. Okay, I guess wishing for a good wedding it was way too much to ask for. I think from now on, I'm just gonna have, just gonna have elopements or very small weddings at the house because it's just way too much effort for it to not work like that. I had a sliver of hope though because of the funeral. The funeral worked out seamlessly. So I thought maybe that they fixed events, but I guess not weddings. God, that was painful. Okay, well, they're married now, so that's good. That's a pro that came out of this um, horrific event. Oh, wow, it's snowing. Um, and also, Sarah's pregnant. This is crazy. Um, I really want to see what she's having. The game hasn't even told me that she's pregnant yet, but she's got a bump. We can't even take a pregnancy test. That's so weird. Eating for two, what? We didn't even get the pop-up. Or did we? Okay, that's very strange. We're just like pregnant and the game didn't bother to tell me. Anyways, so yeah. So Evangeline had her baby right after the wedding. We found out we were pregnant as we were uh, exchanging vows. Um, what else happened? Yeah, that was that was quite quite the wedding. I will not lie. Um, I'm really excited though that Sarah and Marielle are having a baby. I really really want to know what she's having. I think we should look. I think we should look and see. Oh shoot, Eros, why aren't you at school? Ay ay ay. I think we should look and see what she's having, so we can decide on some names ahead of time. Uh, she's having a boy. Oh my god. Oh man. Okay. Well, drop some male names in the comments that um, make sense for Sarah. Like things that have to do with romance and love and all that stuff. Um, yeah. The reason I named Eros Eros is because he's the god of love. And we got Christmas tomorrow. Well, Christmas Eve tomorrow. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna put the piano in our inventory and put the tree up. Is this our first Christmas that we celebrated in this house? Oh no, the last Christmas that we did was at the um, the Christmas cabin. I mean, we could go there again. Okay, let's do the flocked tree. Let's put these winter wreaths on each of the windows. I don't normally go this all out for uh, Christmas decorations but I'm currently decorating for Christmas at my house too. So uh, kind of in the mood, you know? Okay, we need to take down the fall decorations and put up some string lights and then put some Christmas trees out front. Okay, cool. Where's the decoration box again? I think I have it in the greenhouse. Yes. All right, get your booty over here. So I think I want to do red and green twinkling lights. Classic. Oh, wow. That's actually so pretty. I love it. It's so festive. If only it was this easy to decorate in real life. <laughs> I had her rummage for winter decorations and this is what we got. That's a pretty cool way to get decor for free. Um... It's good for like rags to riches kind of stuff. There we go. Size it up. Very pretty. She's so cute with her bump, guys. Aww. Ooh, the kids are back. And they're exhausted. Okay, yeah, they're both so tired. <laughs> All right, I think that if they hang out in Janelle's room for a bit, their mood will go up. They both have projects too. Oh, shoot. Okay, Eris is literally passing out. He's gonna have to go to sleep for real. Is Mari Ellen adult or is she young? I think she's an adult. Yep, she's gonna be an elder in five days. What the heck? Why is time going by so fast? Okay, this is actually insane. Holy crap. They do not have a long time in their life left, do they? How long does Sarah have? 14. Oh my god. Wow. We already maxed nectar making for Ren, but we need to make 
46 more bottles of wine in order to complete your aspiration. We could totally start working on flower arranging too. Oh, let me start a club gathering as well. Get a boost in our household and see Evangeline as well. She has so many flowers in her inventory too. She doesn't have to use any money to make arrangements. <laughs> Sarah's working on her logic skill. She is level nine. So I'm trying to max that. Oh, hey, Evangeline. How are your babies? What did you name them? I'm actually really curious. Are they going to show up? Good thing we can do it through MC Command Center. We can do list children. Kendall and Parker. Samantha, Kendall, and Parker. Cute. Uh, hard to get out of bed, missing them. He barely knew his Grammy, but he's he's really feeling the, the effects of it. Poor guy. Uh-oh. Who is it? Lilith? What? Oh my god. How did that even happen? Holy crap. I... Holy crap. That's really freaking sad. Uh, okay. I... Uh, I think that maybe we should go, I think we should go visit Caleb and try and like make him feel better. I, I would assume that he did not expect that to happen. I didn't expect this to happen. Okay, let's put on your cold weather outfit. Let's go visit him and see if he's doing okay. That is so sad. It had to have been by accident. I really wish you could see how. I can probably like go into cast. Oh my god. Yeah, I can probably go into Cass and see, because it shows, like, cause of death in there. Lilith has been around since the, be the beginning of this challenge. That's insane. She's older than Ren. What the heck happened, dude? That's so sad, though. I love Lilith. She's, like, top three favorite townies. Just the Vitors in general, they're, like, my favorite townies. I don't think we're gonna have a funeral. I don't really feel like it's our place to like have one caleb hi how are you doing console another one are you joking lucian vanilla i don't know who that is sorry it's so dark i can't see anything i don't see how you guys can see anything Dwayne colette oh my god so many deaths please don't say his we're a cabbage tour snow bay Oh my god. That is so sad. Oh man. This sucks. This is so sad, you guys. I can't. Where'd he go? Oh, don't tell me. Oh man, these two. So complicated. This house is really pathetic as well. Another one? Mari. Holy crap. What is going on? All right, let's head home. That was really freaking sad. It's Christmas, so we should be home. Maybe we should invite Caleb to like spend it with us. Well, it's Christmas Eve. I like to like go out and do things on Christmas Eve and then kind of just like do whatever on Christmas Day. That's usually how my family does it too. We always open presents and eat and stuff the day before and then just like veg out the next day. <laughs> I'm so excited for Christmas this year. I feel like I really need it. It's been really, uh, it's been kind of depressing the past couple of years Christmas has been. It just doesn't feel like Christmas. So I'm really hoping that it's different this year. I do think that takes effort on my part though to like make it a good Christmas. Like I can't just like expect it to happen out of nowhere. I gotta put in some effort. Let's get the mail while we're out here. Okay, so decorate, festive spirit, have drinks, bake, yeah. I like to like go and like ice skate and stuff on this day too. Oh, you're making a salad? So healthy of you. Here, let me let me bake some some goods. I uh, max my baking skill so I can literally make anything. What shall we have? What shall we have? Exotic fruit pie, lemon bars, bagels, mm, rice crispy treats. Oh, we gotta make sugar cookies. <laughs> It takes like on the cow's dying. Rest in peace, spotted cow. I know that sugar cookies don't take any baking skill to make in this game, but it's so it's so appropriate for Christmas, am I right? I've already started eating the little pre-made Pillsbury cookies. They're just too good. 
as soon as they hit the stores, I'm like, yup, yup. Janelle, are you watching a scary movie? It's Christmas. I'm having them decorate the tree. This is really loud, isn't it? Kind of a sad song. I think, yeah, you should decorate the tree before Christmas, right? I don't know why I always do it on Christmas. Oh, pregnant Sarah decorating the tree. Oh my goodness. How sweet. I don't think Sarah likes it. Where's Dolly at? I expected her to be up all up in this tree. Ooh, nice. Oh, not that tree skirt. I made a mistake with that. Dude, Sarah is like going through it. It's from this, from her angry grieving. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. All right, now everyone can start adding presents. What does get excited look like? Okay. How sweet. Okay, Ren, how are those cookies coming? What the? What are you doing? What happened to the cookies? Girl? Oh, let's see if I can get Eros and Janelle to be besties. Dude! I can't see! Yay, they're good friends. I think they can become BFFs now. Wingles and... Call Eros a worm kisser. Oh lord. Dude, how do we become BFFs? I actually think that their bar needs to be all the way up, doesn't it? What? Sarah! What are you doing? Oh my god. Where the hell is Marielle? Did she see you do that? She's in here dancing. Oh my god. Sarah, I don't know what the hell's going on with you, but no. Absolutely not. You are pregnant. Is that why you're doing this? Just be friends. No more. Oh my god, I never thought I would have to worry about Patchy. But look! Look at how high that bar is. Do it, Sarah. Oh my god, she's in labor. Yeah, you freaking better. You're lucky Mariel didn't see that. Finally, I can become best friends with her. She needs it for her aspiration. Congrats, you guys. Congrats on your new best friend. Wait, what? Ren? Why? What are you doing that's romantic? Oh, you're just watching. Okay. Whew! I thought you were flirting with Patty, too. I was going to say, dude, calm down, everyone. I'm going to have to delete Patty off the lot if this keeps happening. Another death? Are you joking? I don't know who that is. Why was I scared it was going to be Caleb or something? <laughs> okay. I think... I'm gonna end this episode right here because I do want to hear your guys' name suggestions in the comments. And Sarah is in question mark, question mark, question mark. So she's gonna pop at any second now. I think it's really cute that it's gonna be a Christmas baby. <laughs> oh man, what an episode. All I can say is I wish that the wedding went smoother, but it's just asking a lot. You know what I mean? I hope that you guys enjoyed it regardless. Uh, a little bit of chaos never hurt anybody, but I love you so much. As always, make sure to leave me comments. Let me know what you think. Uh, please, please, please leave me, leave me name suggestions that fit Sarah that have to do with love and romance, maybe even Christmas because it's going to be a Christmas baby. Thank you so much for clicking this video. Thank you for being with me here today. I love you so much and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye. That didn't feel right. Bye. <laughs>